All right, so I'm a little bit late to this information. I was at a meeting for work, and then when I came back from work like two hours ago or so, uh, I just started getting spammed with a bunch of information from this, um, mainly from Andrew. Uh, I did not know. Like, you guys probably know Andrew. If you've been watching me for a while, you know that uh, uh, me and him, like, you know I'm on the channel. But uh, I found out about this information a little bit later, so I apologize for a late upload. But this is some crazy stuff here. So uh, we are going to be getting Classic Blue with Mega Aerodactyl, and they're really good. And then we're also going to be getting red with uh, Snorlax, I can Gigantamax, so that's going to be awesome. Uh, that I was expecting red anyways, but blue, classic blue, I no, <laughs> I was not expecting that. Uh, so this is going to be exciting, and they are going to be lasting like over a month. So if you don't want to summon for them right away, then you can easily wait and uh, summon for them like a month later. Because if you look at the date. They're going to be coming out, well, blue is going to be coming out on September 18th, and then red is going to be coming out on September 16th. Uh, so just two more days for red, and then um, about uh, three to four more days for blue. Uh, but then if you look at their end date, October 30th for blue, and then October 30th for red as well. So you got like a little bit over a month from right now uh, to summon for them. So you don't need to rush and summon for them if you don't want to right now. So they're giving us a lot of time to actually save up some gems if you really want to summon for them. Um, and then over here we got like their Syncrid, which we will take a look at in another video. Um, like we will get more in depth about them. But uh, for Blue, is it going to be the best uh, Rock type striker in the game? I don't think he will be the best Rock type striker because we do have Emmett and uh, Archeops, uh, so they're going to be competing with each other. But uh, that doesn't excuse the fact that uh, Blue is probably going to be a lot of fun. And just from uh, what I looked at uh, already. Uh, he does seem like he's going to be really fun. And then same with uh, Red with Snarlax. They're a support type for the normal type category. Um, they are going to be like probably one of the better supports in uh, the game. Because he can't uh, Gigantamax. And uh, there's two Gigantamax moves over here. Like uh, you have Max Knuckle. So when you use Max Knuckle, uh, you can uh, increase the attack by two stat ranks, which is good. And then you have Gigantamax Replenish. And uh, restores 1 MP of the user's move. So that's going to be very helpful as well. Um, and then he also has uh, Mini Potion All. So you're going to be able to heal everyone on the team. Uh, which is one potion which is going to be good. And there's probably going to be a Mini Potion All Master Healer. So that's going to be really good. And then the training move like it does uh, the typical like uh, reduces sick move countdown and stuff like that. So like we'll get more in depth in another video if I have more time today. If not then I'll do a video tomorrow for sure. But we have a lot more information as well. Um, uh, Giovanni Mewtwo they're going to be able to go 6 stars which is insane because we know how strong they already are. Um, so now that they're going to be able to have the AoE sync it makes them a lot more devastating and they're going to be insane. Uh, and then probably closer to the climax of the story for the Kanto villains um, That's probably when we're gonna be able to mega evolve the uh, Mewtwo that we have because um, It makes more sense for us to uh, fight Giovanni Mega Mewtwo at the climax of the story for this arc uh, or for this Kanto arc whatever uh, And then at the end of that uh, that's when we could probably get uh, Mewtwo to uh, mega evolve as well um, Because like he's not in the coding right now that we can actually mega evolve the Mewtwo from what I saw. So that will probably come a little bit later. But this is the 6 star outfit for blue. It does look really good. I really like that a lot. Um, and then this is the 6 star outfit for red. And that looks really good too. But I'm probably going to stick with the uh, uh, the regular outfit for red. Because it's just nostalgia. And honestly it just looks really good. <laughs> it looks really good. But you can't go wrong with either of the 6 star outfits. And then we have Giovanni here with his 6 star outfit to match Mewtwo. And that looks really good too. Um, and then we have the new Rocket model, uh, the Rocket Grunt. So yeah, that looks cool too. Um, and then when we scroll down more on Absolutely's page. Uh, and by the way, shout out to Absolutely uh, for all this Datamine information. I forgot to do that at the beginning of the video again. But uh, big shout out to him, of course, as always. Um, but uh, we can see over here, the new item is going to be this right here. Uh, Giovanni and Mewtwo 6 Star EX Upgrade. And uh, you're going to need 50 Legendary Spirit to get them the 6 stars. And it makes sense because like for any other uh, character that you want to get a 6 stars, it's going to cost you 50. But this one is going to be specifically 
four Mewtwo. So you can farm this up in an event that's going to be coming out as well. Um, <clears throat> and then when we scroll more down over here, we got the villain event prelude. Um, so this is going to be coming out uh, tonight, I guess. Uh, I think it's going to be coming out uh, tonight on a refresh. So that's going to be exciting. And this is actually really cool art right here when you have uh, blue and red together. And then you have uh, Giovanni with that uh, little lightning bolt going down to separate them. Like, it looks really good. Like, Ma Pokemon Masters, when it comes to their art, they do a really good job. And the quality of their stuff is just really top-notch, too. So, I'm really happy with this. And uh, the event is going to look a lot of fun. The story, I'm excited for. Um, and then we have Giovanni here. Uh, Team Rocket stuff. Um an ad <laughs> uh and then we got the uh information like uh, the stats and everything like they're not bad but like i said we will get more in depth about these characters in a uh uh in another video um then we got another rally coming out and then we got uh tornadoes coming back for the legendary arena because like he's weak to no he's weak to electric electric and rock i think so uh meet blue and uh mega aerodax will probably be good there um, I think he's just weak to electric. I could be wrong. Um, but if any of you guys know, just leave it down in the comments below, of course. <laughs> but uh, I think he is just weak to electric. Um, and then we got the Blissful Bonanza coming back, which is good. Um, and then the uh, Legendary Event for Mewtwo coming back, of course, because we can get them to six stars now. Um, and then we also got the Ghost Type Gear Event coming. So the Ghost Type Gears, uh, you're going to be able to get that to three stars now. So excited about that and this is probably going to be the co-op one like uh with uh what we had before for the rock for emmett and uh what's in it emmett and archie ops i keep forgetting that guy's name <laughs> so uh this is exciting like that three star event like that was really fun so i'm really really excited for this to come back um and uh just more of the same stuff that we have uh but this time with the female model for the rocket grunt and then we have uh, the medals here and this metal actually looks really, really good. Um, that's probably going to be like the full forest battle uh, or, or the prelude. Okay, so yeah, the prelude. Never mind. <laughs> uh, who knows? Maybe it could be a full forest battle. We haven't had that in a while. So hopefully, because I actually do really like those full forest battles. They're a lot of fun. But uh, but yeah, like that metal looks really good. And then these are the new Pokemon that are coming. So Snarlax and then we got the Mega Aerodactyl. So, really excited for that. Um, and obviously, if Mega Mewtwo was coming in this data or this data download, we would have seen it over here, right here. Uh, like, we would have seen it, and uh, that's when we know we could have uh, Mega Evolved uh, Mewtwo, like, right away. But, he's not here, so that's probably going to come, like, closer to the climax of the story for Kanto. Uh, so, probably not anytime soon. But, uh, we'll see, we'll see. Maybe they could throw a curveball at us, and uh, upon the release of uh, the story... They're like, oh yeah, here, you could mega evolve this Mewtwo right now too. So, <laughs> who knows? We'll see in the future. But that's, I think, everything. Uh, we have these. Oh, we have these other items here. We got the legendary spirit for Mewtwo and Giovanni, and then we got the five star ticket for Kanto, and then we have the mini potion all because that's like the new like little icon that uh, Bl uh, Red and Snorlax is gonna have. And then we got the sync move animations here, like, they actually look really good. And then we got the Gigantamax move, like, Snorlax looks so good when he's Gigantamax, it looks really cool. Um, but yeah, this is the quick little animation. Uh, I'm not gonna show everything here because, like I said, we're gonna get more in-depth and uh, show more details in another video specifically for red and blue. But, uh, that's his training move, like, that looks good. Like, that looks good, the animation on red with what they did. And then they had Pallet Town in the background, like, that looks really good. And then you have blue over here, really nice too, clean animation, and the Mega Aerodactyl. Um, like overall, like Pokemon Master, like they just keep getting better and better with what they do, which like you'd want these companies to do. Like over time, they get better, and Pokemon Masters, they definitely got better over time. So I'm really happy with that. But uh, but yeah, that's about it. Um, there's a lot here. Uh, obviously, we got some more art. Um, for Blue, Giovanni, Mega Mewtwo, um, like, there's a lot, but, uh, that's about it, uh, big shout out to Absolutely, of course, for all the information, again, if, uh, you want to check out their, uh, full details right now, like, uh, I'll have Absolutely's Twitter in the description if you want to take a look at everything yourself as well, but uh, I will have an in-depth video talking about Blue and Red, 
and um, seeing where they stand among like the support types and uh, the striker types. So that's going to be it. Let me know what you guys think of this update that's going to be coming for Pokemon Masters. Um, definitely exciting. And uh, I'm really looking forward to everything that's coming for Pokemon Masters. And the two-year anniversary was fun. I enjoyed it. They did a great job. And um, continuing on after the two-year anniversary, they're still hitting it home run. Like they're, like, they're doing a great job. Let me know what you guys think of everything that's going on. That's going to be up for this video. And I will see you guys later.